Uh, hello everybody and welcome back to 5 Minute Crypto, the channel where we cover the most important crypto news in just 5 minutes, back again with another breaking news episode. So it's pretty funny, every time I make a video on 5 Minute Crypto, a couple minutes later, the price just really pumps past the, the price we talked about in that video, because every time I record one, I have to scrap it and make a new one, just because we made a new all-time high for Bitcoin. Funny enough, it was like at 29,000 that this happened, at 31,000 or 33,000, I've deleted three videos in two days. What's going on? It's been pretty damn crazy. But yes, Ethereum is reaching $1,000 just now, and most likely by the time that I upload this, because it's going to take like an hour or so, we'll have seen some huge deviation from this price, most likely. Bitcoin is at 33 point something thousand with an all-time high here at almost 35,000, well actually 34.5 thousand, going still insane though, and this is actually Bitcoin's anniversary. Bitcoin hits record high on the 12th anniversary of its creation. Cryptocurrencies passes $30,000 as financial institutions express growing interest. And yes guys, today is the 12th anniversary of Bitcoin. Pretty crazy to see how long we've been in the space, at least I have now. And pretty cool to see how we're still that early, at least in my opinion, because we're in the first 12 years of crypto. That is insane. Also, Doge gone wild. Meme coin soars after adult star says she's a holder. So Doge coin is mostly called the pump coin, pump and dump coin. Somebody said, been holding my Doge since 2014, much patience, much moon by Angel White on Friday night. Angela White, whatever. And basically, Dogecoin is a coin which is mostly made for fun. Elon Musk often talks about this one. And even though it doesn't have many fundamentally interesting aspects, except for the meme part, it is an interesting coin. It's pretty well built. It doesn't get updates anymore. And it's really just there for the memes. However, it does get good pumps and dumps every so now. Uh, and then, and thus, it's not necessarily the worst hold of your life. If you like losing lots of money, uh, you know, in very short amount of time. <laughs> but again, it can just pump and dump. That's basically what Doge does. That's basically what it is built for. Pump and dump and just be there for the memes. And then XRP Army petitions White House to stop SEC's lawsuit against Ripple. A member of the XRP community has filed a petition with the White House requesting the SEC lawsuit to be halted. The petition cites that FinCEN already declared XRP a currency. Furthermore, the SEC lawsuit against Ripple has caused massive damages to XRP holders, and such financial damage is in contrast to the SEC's mandate to protect retail investors, basically serving as the exact opposite with what they tried. XRP is being called a security by the SEC. They've been charged for that, Ripple the company behind XRP. However, since XRP was officially called a currency before by FinCEN, a lot of people think this is actually way... First of all, way overdue, just way out of place, and also it is definitely diminishing all the gains that people would have had, even if this turns out to be a wrong call. If it turns out to be the wrong call, it will still be a very, very bad piece of judgment, as most people who then bought in to XRP with the you know with thought of getting gains out of it or just for buying it, who cares really, uh, could have actually gotten them by just holding on through had it not been for this huge and really crazy lawsuit. But hey, hopefully we'll see a huge pump here. I'm actually still rooting for it because while well, most coins are pumping and most coins are doing crazy, uh, may, we might see a crazy red Monday. We've often seen that happen, especially after huge pumps. I mean, pumps cannot continue forever. And I kind of feel as if a pullback must be coming one of these days. But however, I keep stalling that because the, the pullback just doesn't come. Ethereum just keeps on gaining. Right now, we're above $1,000 officially. We're nearing the all-time high, and I don't think it's very far around the corner, guys. I I definitely think we're in kind of a phase like this right here. Where it's just the start of something way bigger. I still think huge prices are going to be turned on eventually. But hey. I'm just a random guy in it, though. Don't take this as financial advice. I'm just a random guy. Hopefully, you all enjoyed it, though. Make sure you press the like button and subscribe. And I will definitely see you guys again in another crypto video. Take care, everybody. And, uh, yeah, have a nice one.